Right now, an object the size of a city, traveling at over 200,000 kilometers per hour, is making its closest approach to our sun. It's called 3I Atlas, and it's only the third interstellar object, a visitor from another star system, we have ever detected. But this is not just another comet. As it gets closer to the sun, scientists are finding anomalies. Anomalies so strange that some top astrophysicists are asking if this is a natural object at all, or the first definitive proof of an alien probe. This is the current update on 3i Atlas, and the story is getting stranger by the day. So what do we know for sure? 3i Atlas was discovered in July 2025. The 3i in its name means it's the third interstellar object ever found. After the mysterious Oumuamua in 2017 and the Comet 2 i Borisov in 2019. This one is a big deal because we found it before its closest approach giving us a frontline seat. NASA's Hubble and the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, immediately got to work. Hubble gave us our sharpest look, confirming it has a coma, a gas cloud, and estimating its solid nucleus to be massive. Anywhere from 300 meters to over 5.6 kilometers, or 3.5 miles across. But the James Webb Space Telescope gave us the real headline. By analyzing its chemical fingerprint, scientists found its gas cloud is dominated by carbon dioxide, not water like our comets. This tells us 3i Atlas likely formed in the extremely cold outer reaches of its home star system on what we call the carbon dioxide ice line. This is a pristine sample from another solar system, but that's where the normal science ends. This is the part of the update that has the internet and the scientific community buzzing. Harvard astrophysicist Avi Loeb has pointed out several anomalies that are hard to explain. First, the sunward jet. Comet tails are pushed by the solar wind, so they always point away from the sun. But images of 3i Atlas show a bright jet of material pointing towards the sun. This is highly unusual and not easily explained by our current models. Second, the industrial metal. This is the biggest one. Analysis of the gas plume shows it's ejecting a high amount of nickel, but with no iron. According to Loeb, this specific composition has never been seen in a natural object in our solar system. The only place we see this ratio? In industrially produced nickel alloys made right here on Earth. Third, the perfect trajectory. Of all the infinite paths it could take, 3i Atlas is flying almost perfectly in plane with our own planets within five degrees of the ecliptic. The odds of this are incredibly small. So, a sunward jet, an industrial metal signature, and a suspicious orbit. It's easy to see why the alien probe theory is gaining traction, which brings us to right now. Today is October 24th, 2025. You can't go out and see 3i Atlas. It's currently in solar conjunction, meaning it's on the other side of the sun from our point of view. And this is where it gets critical. Its closest approach to the sun, its perihelion, is happening in just a few days around October 29th. This is the ultimate test. If 3i Atlas is just a natural, though very weird, comet, it will whip around the sun and continue on its path maybe flaring up or breaking apart from the intense heat. But if it's an artificial probe, this is the moment it could perform an Oberth maneuver, a powered burn at its closest and fastest point to dramatically change its trajectory. If it slows down, if it turns, that would be the smoking gun. We can't see it, but our spacecraft can. Probes around Mars already observed it as it passed by in early October. So, we are in a historic moment of suspense. Is 3i Atlas the most fascinating natural object we've ever studied, giving us a direct sample of another star's building blocks? Or is it the black swan event, the first handshake from another civilization? We won't know until it reappears from behind the sun in early December, and we can check its trajectory. Until then, the world holds its breath. Subscribe to our channel for more updates on this story.